due to a shortage of monkeypox vaccine in the United States. Seattle resident Justin Moore and friends driving to Vancouver for the shot. So it became apparent to me that like I was going to have to potentially seek out other places. But if anyone else wants to do what Moore did, it's clear now that other place is closed. I'd say to our friends in the United States, they now have, I think, access to the vaccine in Washington State in greater amounts. Uh, don't come here because it's for uh, people living here. Health authorities updating their policy and websites Thursday. Due to limited supply, this vaccine is intended for residents of Canada or those visiting BC for prolonged periods of time. It reads, people from outside Canada should not travel to VCH vaccine clinics for immunization. We cannot provide the vaccine to those visiting the province for the purpose of being vaccinated. We're not running out of vaccine, but we're using the vaccine we have prudently. Monkeypox has been declared a public health emergency in the U.S. The vaccine eligible mainly for men having sex with other men, the community where the virus has been most common. So far in B.C., 98 confirmed cases of the virus. In Washington state, the number climbs to 254. We have under 100 cases of mon monkeypox in B.C., which is below what you would expect for our jurisdiction our size. Even though Americans are no longer welcome to get their monkeypox vaccine in Canada, there will be no change in policy in terms of taking ID. The government wants this to be low barrier, like during Pride Week, to get as many people in the community vaccinated as possible. The B.C. Liberals think the government should make things much tighter. Um, we, we can't have our already stressed uh, health care system uh, now being taken fully you know, advantage of by Americans that are coming up here to get uh, our health care at no cost, by the way. Monkeypox can be painful, but so far no one in B.C. has died from it. Richard Zulsman, Global News, Victoria.